Okay, welcome back. Today we are going to be talking about map connections a little bit. We've already talked about them before in our Pori map video, um, but I thought I'd make a really quick video just going over them again so people could find the information faster since they are not labeled in the title of the main Pori script video, Pori map video. So anyway, I have created a new map here. I just, you know, added it into this main map group and I put it down at the bottom here. It's just called a little root extension. Um, I am now in the connections tab and I want to connect this into our little root town on the right hand side. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up here, I'm going to create a new map connection. As you can see, there's one connection now and you can create up to four. Um, now you can use this um, drop down here to decide where you want it to be. We want it to be on the left because we want little root to be coming in this way. Um, and then you can change the map right here and we're changing it to Little Root Town. Now, if you have mirror to connecting maps here, this will connect the changes that you make here to Little Root. So now in Little Root, we should be able to go and there's a map here as well. This is the map that we were just on. We can double click onto it here. We can double click onto it here. We can go back and forth. So um, that's how you add a map connection. You can add another one if you want, if you want one here. So we can make it up and we can change the map to be uh, this, that's a bad one, but this, that's also a bad one. It doesn't really matter. Um, you can change the map to be whatever you want and you can move it so that it lines up better. Um, this is obviously a bad example. We should just do 101. So if we want to move 101 to now be on this side of Little Root, we can. And now it's right here. So now you would be able to walk in through Little Root and then walk up through here into Route 101 and it would mirror these changes. Now we don't want this so we want to delete it but be careful this one is highlighted so if I delete that map connection I need to click on this one and then delete this one and that deletes the map connection. So you click on the map connections um, that are highlighted and that's how you change them. So if you're wondering like how to get between the map connections that you have you just click on them here. Um, and then, you know, this is Route 101, this is Little Root Extension, Route 101, Little Root Extension. Now, also, there's the dive map and the emerge map. Now, this is pretty simple. Each map can have a dive map and a, an emerge map. It can only have one of each, so you can only have one diving location um, for each. Let's see, let's try to find one here. So this one has a diving map, and it is Underwater Route 127. So in all of these dive sections here, um, it's going to take you to underwater route 127. Now it might take you to a different location and um, there's, you know, code that handles that. Um, but this is where the actual map is chosen that you're going to dive to. And then when we're in our dive map, um, I'd have to go to it here. Now we see we have an emerge map. And this means that if we're on this map, this is our dive map. If we want to go up, we can use dive to go up, and this is the map that we go up into. Um, and again, I believe it's you know based just on your X and Y position relative to the two maps. Um, so that is how dive and emerge maps work for your map connections. So pretty simple stuff. We now you know can add maps onto our section. We can extend our towns if we want to use multiple maps to make like different shaped towns if we want but you know you could turn this into a new route and extend it out and whatnot um, however you know fits your game um, but for now that is what we're going to we're going to wrap up our maps uh, you know our map connections um, I'm going to end the video here so that it's pretty short if you have any questions make sure to leave a comment in the YouTube video or on the discord otherwise we'll see you on the next one